This video was brought to you by Stoltenberg, a bedroom planner, Mr. Green, Ken Power, and Marcus Biel. We're now at home. I've been out uh, actually all night testing some cars, uh, doing some acceleration tests, some headlight tests. It's now four at night. I was sitting here entering data for the new EL7, and you guys can hear the bass. Inside, it's not that much, but I can show you. Let's go outside. Okay, now we're outside the house. Okay, let's see, as usual, this is what happens. There is a bus, oh, it's one over there. Okay, it's not this one. I can hear it. It's one document how loud it is. Right over there. I talked to one of my neighbors. Uh, he said that uh, he's going to work really early, but he said that um, uh, wife, his wife is probably calling the police right now. I might have to switch it to a high mode. It's a, it's a, there's a low mode and a high mode. Right here. Yeah, okay, let's check. Now we get close to the bus. So we get a little closer. Now we are just a couple of meters away from it. You can probably not hear me very much because... Okay, here it's really loud. The problem is that that side is pointing right towards our house. Sure, what it looks like. They are there. The houses are over there. Would be slightly better if they were actually the other way. So, yeah, okay. Let me, let me measure again. Okay, that's uh, oh, that was that was way too loud, man. That was way too loud. So yeah, uh, that bus over there is not doing anything. Holy shit! <sighs> yeah, um, fortunately they're leaving now. <laughs> so yeah, this is what we have to deal with on daily basis, pretty much. Um, yeah, so I'm just documenting what's going on, uh, no drama, anything, 
So yeah, uh, I have to actually be careful when I step around here. It could be litter, it could be shit, it could be urine over here. Who knows? So let me just show you again the distances here. Is that the buses, they are typically... Actually, this one wasn't the worst because you can see the distance makes a huge impact on sound levels. When it's really, really loud, for, for us is when the buses are parked either here or on the other side at the bus stop there. Then it becomes really loud because it's literally just 10 meters away from our house. And it's not only our house, there's plenty of other houses over there. And also, you might be wondering, Bjorn, uh, why do you make these videos? Well, uh, it actually affects our lives because Think about this, I was out testing cars, I came home, I input some data, uh, in regular routine, I log how far I've driven, uh, I input the, the, the data I've gathered in the spreadsheet, preparing them for, uh, for my uh, videos, and then my plan was to go get some sleep. Because tomorrow, actually in just six or seven, uh, in around six hours, I'm supposed to wake up and then uh, return some press cars and pick up Neo ET5 and then I'm supposed to drive a range test with it but now I, I'm bothered by this noise and I don't know if uh, Isabel woke up or not we can check by the way well actually uh, maybe I should check if it's safe to show yet um, oh, fortunately fortunately Isabel did not wake up we have a um, we have a camera a baby camera and I can see that uh, Isabel did not wake up for I, I think it has something to do with that that they were playing over there but if they played over there really loud then the freaking windows would shake yeah so uh, is this relevant for the channel no uh, except for that it might actually affect my performance if you say that my my, perf my working performance when it comes to uh, testing cars. I try to be awake. I try to have, you know, uh, my mind should be clear. I should get enough sleep. But the every year, these months here, around uh, April, May, this shit happens very often. And yeah, it kind of, you can say, it doesn't stop me from doing what I do, but it uh, it disturbs what I'm supposed to do, right? So. Now you guys seen it, there wasn't too much drama. Seems like <laughs> actually, those, those, actually those guys, they invited me into the bus. So, okay, I actually went inside and we just wanted to measure how loud is it right next to the speakers. <laughs> 110 decibel. Uh, I felt uncomfortable in there. Actually, I, I, I didn't want to film people, that's the thing. I film mostly the, the device, but uh, um, uh, many people in there, they use the what do you call it, Hörschewan. They use those, uh, those things to block, <laughs> block sound. That's how loud it is. I mean, if they need to use those devices, I mean, those, uh, you know, uh, why do they even play that loud? Why do they, don't they just play le not so loud? <laughs> I, I don't get it, man. But uh, the main problem is that they are disturbing the neighbors. So uh, I don't think that the police will come here, uh, given the situation now because uh, it's, it's a weekday and uh, there are not that many um, Rusebus. There was just one or two, yeah, and some of them left already. So, um, yeah, and we don't see any police yet. So it's, this is usually, you know, cat and mouse that uh, they come here, they play for, let's say, half an hour. Yeah, it was actually, normally I don't just, every time I hear music, I don't, I don't run out here r right away because sometimes they just play for, a couple of minutes maximum five ten minutes and then they leave and that's fine yeah but these guys they were actually playing here for some time and i was just sitting there working and i was like are they not gonna leave no they didn't i mean i had time to put on my clothes grab my equipment and walk over here and they were still here so yeah but this is typically what i say is like cat and mouse that sometimes we call the police uh, but then by the time the police is here they have already gone. And oh yeah, I forgot to, uh, to highlight something else. Littering. Uh, uh, how, how long has it been here? Um, this one, for example. 
This one seems to have been here a while, but it's from McDonald's. And holy crap, I didn't know it was like this. Look at, uh, this one is fresh because we have ice cubes. So this one is from tonight, not last night. Um, here, most likely, also, you see over here, we have beer cans. No, that is not beer cans, some, some drinks. But here, this is beer can. And let me just feel it. Uh, I need to wash my hands afterwards. Yeah, um, what else? I think I saw broken glass also. Oh shit. Uh, no, this is not broken glass, it's broken something else. It's plastic, fortunately, but it's, um, I don't know what it is. But you see, here are the chargers. Normally, the guys would be backing up here, charging during the daytime. So I think McDonald's, they actually clear the place all the way here or, or something. But they don't clear all the way over there. But just look at the amount of litter you have here. This one, uh, I'm not sure how old it is. Trying to see here. Yeah, litter over here also. Some buns that nobody wanted to eat or finish. Um, let me see this one This one is most likely from from this night because normally there will be cars here and they were even back over it or yeah, There's the other bus leaving now Okay, let's see um, Normally if Okay, you can see that something is colder uh, This could indicate that this is fr well, no wait Yeah, this one it seems to be warmer than ambient, right? I see five degrees Celsius. Yeah, six degrees Celsius. And the, and the tarmac here is, yeah, there seems to be, okay, it's been here a little bit, so, but you can see that there is a temp difference. So this one was built most likely recently. Otherwise, there won't be any difference there in temperature. Okay, the metal uh, re reflects uh, the camera. It messes up with the camera. But this beer seems cold, colder than... Nah, I'm not sure. I'm just trying to see if I can find anything interesting by looking at the thermal camera. Uh, we have... Uh, yeah, yeah, I want to check something here. The temperature on the milkshake. Can we see any temperature readings there? Three degrees Celsius. Um, what about ambient temperature here? Five degrees. It could be that that milkshake is fairly fresh. Yeah, what else? Uh, did that one pee behind here? Not that that matters though. Well, I, maybe it, wo it won't leave a signature. Well, what the heck? Just realized. Smirnoff. Okay, nowadays they don't use glass. Okay, that's good at least. Okay, more McDonald's litter. Wait, this one. Oh, this is fresh. Uh, uh, we had nice weather today, so it should evaporate by now if, if, it, was, if it was littered a uh, long time ago. So this is also likely to have occurred recently. What the heck, man? So much litter? Huh? Seriously? Uh, spoon, also from McDonald's. What else is it? Okay, let me just walk. Oh, is this salad? Yeah, this is salad from something. Um, and then I saw something over here. Let me check. But yeah, you, I don't know if you see that the buses, they were parked around here. Right where all the litter just happened to also be. Oh, look at this. Holy crap, man. Uh, like, are these guys blind? Don't they see... Okay, there is some trash here, which is good, but not nearly enough. Look at this. Oh, actually, they tend to fill the, the trash bins. But even if they are full, or not even half full, now there is still plenty of space here to put more litter there. Here also, I guess, should be fairly fresh, right? It seems to be colder than ambient temperature. But it is quite cold outside, also. 
But I guess if you look at the rock here, the rock might cool down slower. Uh, I think air temperature right now is around uh, two, two, three degrees Celsius. But the rock here is still at seven degrees Celsius because it cools down slower. But here, yeah, this should be fresh. But just by looking at this one. And then here, yeah, this is the one, uh, uh, Hörselwarn. Parts of it that dropped during something, I don't know. Oh, there's police! The police are here, finally! You guys came too late to the party! <laughs> well, at least they showed up. But you see, the, the, this is exactly what I mean. It's the cat and mouse. In Sotleder, I might, I might have talked to them before. It's like the cat and mouse. Uh, we call the police, they arrive after half an hour, but then all the Rus, they have already gone. There is one Rusibus over there if they want to talk to them. But just look at the amount of litter here. <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know if these police guys care that the, our neighborhood is getting littered down. So, let me show you more. Um, yeah, 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 this is the one I was talking about. Yeah, yeah, so, so some, they, it broke. But they didn't bother throwing it in the trash. So, yeah. Uh, what, huh? Some kind of medicine? I'm not sure. What is this? Utrivin. Oh, yeah, okay, okay. Utrivin, yeah. It's a uh, uh, nose uh, thing, uh, yeah. So, but uh, the trash can is right there. You know? What else can we see here? Um. Yeah, maybe I'm done for now. But yeah, now you guys see <laughs> how it is over here in my neighborhood. Bullet size here. <laughs> well, well, well. Is it time to go home now?